the singing of the Philippine National Anthem. standing let's bow our heads and put ourselves in the presence of the lord for the nbl prayer in the name of the father and of the son and of the holy spirit amen heavenly father we thank you for bringing us together in the spirit of sportsmanship to celebrate the talents you have given us in the game of basketball please bless everyone here today that everyone plays to the best of their abilities May you also protect all our players from any injuries. Please keep everyone here safe to the moment we all get home tonight. All this we ask in your name. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Good day, basketball fans, and welcome to the opening ceremonies of the 2021 seasons of the Pia Cayetano Women's National Basketball League and the Chukstugo National Basketball League of the Philippines. My name is Mark Zambrano, and we are gathered here today, both in person and virtually, from across the country and even the globe, for a milestone in Philippine basketball. This marks the opening of the season of not one, but two leagues that aim to help elevate the talent and grit of Pinoy Hoops. This is brought to you by the NBL Pilipinas Corporation, which organizes the following leagues. The NBL 5-on-5 and 1v1, the WNBL 5-on-5, 3x3, and 1v1, the NBL Youth, Boys, and Girls Divisions, and the NCL National Collegiate League. To begin our festivities, we would like to call on the pillars of the NBL Pilipinas, starting off with a veteran businessman and visionary contributing across a multitude of industries, NBL Chairman and President, Mr. Celso Mercado. An experienced sports official with decades of experience as a referee in basketball and other officiating duties. Vice President for Basketball Operations and NBL Commissioner, Mr. Edward Aquino. And a stellar marketer with decades worth of imprint in the Philippine sports industry, NBL Executive Vice President, Ms. Rose Montreal. We begin our festivities with the season opening of the Pia Cayetano Women's National Basketball League of the Philippines or WNBL Pilipinas. Today, we will not only open a new season for our cage bells, we will also be celebrating its metamorphosis into becoming the country's first ever professional women's basketball league. In this inaugural season as a pro league, the WNBL is privileged to be named after the Honorable Senator Pia Cayetano, who has advocated women's rights and development through sports throughout her many years in public service. She has prepared a message in line with this milestone in Philippine basketball, 
Here is her message for the league. Warm greetings to all of you. I am so excited to be part of this day. Today is truly a historic day for the Filipinos because we now have a professional basketball league for women. I have been part of the sports community for many years. I have been an athlete for most of my life and I know what it's like to train as an athlete. I know what it's like to be excited to play the game that you love. I am happy that there is now a venue for players to continue playing after their college day. But more than all that, I am happy that you now will be the inspiration. You will provide the images, the role models for the future generation of young athletes, young girls who can see that there is a future for them in sports, that they can play the sports that they love. So remember to embody the ideals of true sportsmanship. Always be a good athlete, always be a shining example to the young girls especially watching, and also to the young boys. We need to show the young boys that young girls can play this game too. So on that note, let me extend my best wishes and um, special greetings to each and every team the glutagen glow boosters the paranyake lady aces the Keson lady spartans the pacific water queens and the tagig lady generals each of you each one of you whatever role you play whatever position you have no matter how many minutes you play in the game will serve as an inspiration to the future generation of players, and even to women like me, my age, older. So keep that in mind in everything that you do on and off the court. So all the best to you. Thank you to the organizers for making this happen. WNBL, you will go down in history. Let's keep this fair. Let's keep this safe, not just for the players and the teams, for their families. Let's follow the health protocols and let's shine and show the world what the Filipina women basketball players can do. God bless you all. Thank you very much, Senator Cayetano, for inspiring all of us here today. Now, to celebrate this milestone in sports, we will be honoring six personalities and entities that were instrumental to women's basketball in the country. As the overall brand and quality of Pinoy Hoops gains more traction internationally, we are truly excited to help uplift and shine the spotlight on the L would not be possible if not for the groundwork laid by these said personalities and entities. May we ask WNBL Executive Vice President Ms. Rose Montreal to read the citation inscribed on the plaques we will be bestowing. National Basketball League Philippines, Women's National Basketball League, to Commissioner Jose Lier Giao, Mr. Bernardo Gabriel Atienza, Ms. Vivian Manila, Milo Best Center, Discovery Suites Incorporated, and Ever Belena Cosmetics. We would like to present to you this plaque for your valuable contribution and generous support to the development of Philippine women's basketball, taking the sport to unprecedented heights and its proper place in the nation's sporting landscape. Given this 18th day of July 2021 at the Brent C. Giao Convention Center, signed Celso O. Mercado, Chairman President, Edward T. Aquino, Vice President for Basketball Operations, and yours truly, Rose Montreal, Executive Vice President. Thank you very much, Ms. Rose Montreal. Now, we would like to recognize the following entities and personalities for being instrumental in the development of young Filipinas up to their teens in honing the skills, mindset, and love for the game of basketball nationwide. This citation goes to the Milo Best Center.
for providing our young Filipinas as an additional avenue to compete and develop in the collegiate ranks, as well as leading the charge in having sufficient representation in the WNCAA's board. This citation goes to Maria Vivian P. Manila, President of the Women's National Collegiate Athletic Association. For always being a willing partner to women's basketball in the Philippines, especially for the national teams such as Perlas Pilipinas and Gilas Pilipinas Women, this citation goes to Ever Bilena Corporation. For being a staunch supporter of the women's national basketball team, particularly during its years known as Perlas Pilipinas. This citation goes to Miss Cynthia Chu. For spearheading the grassroots development initiatives of the Samahang Basketball ng Pilipinas, which have helped Filipinas all over the country develop and dream, this citation goes to Bernie Atienza. Samahang Basketball ng Pilipinas Deputy Executive Director. For championing women's basketball, not just in various clinics and outreach programs, but also in the amateur ranks, this citation goes to Hoselier Yeng Giao, Head Coach and General Manager of the NLEX Road Warriors in the PBA. Now let's listen to the speech of Sir Yang Giao. Ito po si Coach Yang Giao ng NLEX Road Warriors. Uh, sa ilalim po ng aking commissionership noong nakaraang mga taon, nung ako po ay uh, commissioner pa ng PBL, ay amin pong naitaguyod ang WPBL na kung saan po ay binigyan natin ng pagkakataon ang mga basketbolistang uh, mga babae na magkaroon ng uh, uh, kanilang sarili pong liga na kung saan ay ipakikita nila kanilang galing. Pero ngayon po, gusto ko pong i-congratulate ang WNBL Pilipinas ni Ma'am Rose Montreal for continuing the advocacy and uh, uh, supporting uh, women's sports and women's basketball. Congratulations uh, Ma'am Rose and to the WNBL Pilipinas and uh, on behalf of uh, the PBL board noong pong ako ay commissioner uh, sa ilalim po ni Chairman uh, Robert Kwan noon kasama pa po namin si na uh, Boss Terrique, si na Raymond Liu, si na Cecilio Pedro, si na Giselle Ducey at uh, mga ibang uh, miyembro po ng board nung araw, sila po ang tumulong uh, para po maitaguyod po yung WPPL nung araw. Tinatanggap ko po ang karangalan na ibinibigay niyo sa akin. At sana po ay lalo pa pong lumakas at tumagal ang WNBL. Congratulations po. Pagbutihan po natin. I'm sure mananagumpay po tayo. Thank you very much, Coach Yang. Now let's listen to a special message from Mr. Bernie Atienza. Good day, everyone, especially to the lovers of Philippine women's basketball. I'm indeed happy to be around and I uh, would like to thank you for this nomination. And of course, I accept with all my heart. Uh, I thank you, not only for this award, but more so on uh, such efforts that you have, uh, WNBL, for organizing these tournaments that will definitely develop, contribute to the development of women's basketball in the country. Please go on, because this is what we need. I remember that uh, during the uh, 70s, 80s, we tried to organize uh, with so much difficulty. There was, uh, of course, 
the founding of the WNCAA in 1972. Uh, I remember the late Charlie Martin uh, putting out his uh, all-out effort uh, together with his group. Then uh, we came in late 70s, uh, early 80s. We organized. I coached, and uh, together with the late Nilo Verona, or what we call, who we call Tatay Nilo, and uh, we had the likes of the late Tony Ginto also, and our friends from FEU, PIP, CD, Kirino. Uh, Rolly Tumapat, or PCCR, and Dami Ding Tolencio. We were all there with all enthusiasm, but what really made it uh, hard for us was the lack of corporate sponsors. You are indeed happy, I mean lucky, to have such corporate sponsors as in the likes of Mr. Ronald Mascarinas. Suerte kayo because uh, this is what is, it is all about, corporate support and corporate sponsorships. Please go on with all your efforts. I really thank you for this. Para naman ang mga manlalaro nating babae sa Pilipinas ay makinabang at not improve. And uh, for this, congratulations on your opening of the season. Uh, I am, you can be assured that I will be around for all, for any kind of support. Thank you. Thank you very much, Mr. Bernie Atienza. Now, aside from these outstanding personalities and institutions, we also will be enshrining four outstanding Filipinas into the Women's Legion of Legends. We would like to give due recognition to some of the outstanding personalities of women's basketball in the Philippines who have poured in their share of blood, sweat, and tears for the game we love and have thus become instrumental in the development of women's basketball in the process. This is the WNBL's way of expressing its gratitude to these pioneer generations to thrive. Our first inductee into the Women's Legion of Legends is Miss Emelia Vega. Una-una po, napapasalamat po ako kay Ma'am Rose Montreal po sa binigay niya po na karangalan sa akin na maging mabilang sa Hall of, of, Hall of Fame sa Women's Basketball. At papasalamat din na siya yung kauna-unang nag-organize ng Women's Basketball sa Pilipinas po na professional league ng women's basketball. Salamat din ako sa Adamson University na doon talaga nahubog yung talent ko bilang basketball player na kinuha ako sa gayong probinsya po. Uh, sa coaches ko po sa Adamson at saka national team, maraming salamat po sa laging coach ko po. Mula 1991 hanggang 2007 sa career ko ng national team, maraming salamat po. Marami po ako natutunan at yun din ang tinuro ko bilang naging coach na po ako. Congratulations, Ms. Emelia Vega. Now, we would also like to induct Professor Cristina Columna. Hello, si Cristina Columna. Um, ako ay nagpapasalamat sa WNBL para sa pagnanominate sa ako. Sobrang saya ko kasi na napili ako. Papasalamat ako doon sa taga tumulong sa akin, sa nagkilala sa akin dito. Uh, maraming maraming salamat sa si Chico Tsaid kasi yung naging coach ko. And then, talagang pag magkasama kami sa uh, pagkasabay lang po kami uh, try out sa Kaya lang mas uh, headbox sa kanya, pero nung dumating yung time na nagko-coach siya, naging coach siya, o naging player niya. Pero naging samahan naman namin yung talagang naging magkaibigan, magkapatid, at naging close ko sa pamilya niya. Kaya pinasasalamatan ko din po siya. 
And then, hanggang ngayon po, uh, sinasuportahan pa rin niya po pagdating sa uh, pag-coach at uh, sa basketball. Uh, maraming maraming salamat kasi ito ang aking uh, naglaro. Ito ang aking pinapang. Sa mga maglalaro sa professional women's na sa basketball, um, sana uh, disiplinahin natin ang sarili natin. Um, ito ay isang magandang experience na talagang hindi niyo makakalimutan. Dahil pag talaga nasa basketball kayo, uh, alam niyo na tayo kahit mga maliliit na liga ng basketball Pero ito, ibang, ibang uh, experience, mga experience na nangyayari sa inyo. Kaya gawin natin ang lahat, mag-training, disiplina, then para maging uh, inspirasyon din tayo sa mga bago pang maglalaro or natututo pang maglaro ng mga basketball. Congratulations, Professor Columna. Now, let's all give due recognition to another professor, Professor Elizabeth Tan. Uh, good morning. Uh, I'm Elizabeth Tan. Uh, I would like to thank the organizers of WNBL for, for giving me the opportunity to be if to be selected uh, for Lofamer in their league. And I would like to thank everyone who have uh, helped me in achieving whatever I, I have accomplished. My players, my, my co-coaches, uh, everyone who, who, who came into my life that gave me the courage and the, the opportunity to be what I, I am today. Uh, for my for the players, the come players that are, are aspiring to be play hard and be disciplined enough to follow whatever rules the coach would give you. Don't look at it as monetary uh, uh, pleasure for you. It would, it would only be more on your skills. Just you show them that we women can do what men do. And I hope that uh, this could be a very successful uh, tournament. Sa lahat lahat, thank you. And to the organization itself, I hope you prosper and I hope that whatever whatever outcome ng league natin, ng league ninyo ngayon, sana maging successful at prosperous so that the girls will also be more give, will be given more chance to to show their ano, skills as well to professor elizabeth tan and last but not the least we would like to induct miss heidi ong who is also the wnbl 3x3 commissioner and at the same time a member of the technical group
corporation headed by Mrs. Cynthia P. Plus Irwin of Charity, my former teammates, and many more. And I would like to congratulate the current players and teams of the WNBL. This will be another milestone for women's basketball. And I would like to congratulate each and everyone. Mabuhay po tayo. all the inductees of our Women's Legion of Legends. Let's now listen to a special message from the WNBL and NBL's Executive Vice President, Ms. Rose Montreal, one of the drivers of this milestone in women's basketball, who did not lose hope of one day having a first ever female pro basketball league in the country. Hello and welcome, ladies and gentlemen. It is indeed a very special day for all of us as we open a new chapter of our beloved league. The Women's National Basketball League, WNBL Filipinas, was established two years ago with the intention of providing Filipinas the platform to showcase their skills in front of a national audience. Unsurprisingly, our invitation was answered by countless talented players who were eager to show that they are all about. The maiden season has been a tremendous success, with exciting action capturing fans' attentions every weekend, whether live at the venues or through broadcast media. The presence on digital media has likewise been one of the bright spots of WNBL, with live stream and other content consist consistently having a large number of organic reach and engagement. WNBL Filipinas continued to thrive, even with the challenges brought upon by COVID-19 pandemic. When the league was granted pro status with the assistance of Chairman Bahamitra, it opened the doors for more financial opportunities to our talented and deserving Filipina players in the upcoming season. And that is not the only exciting development to take place as of late. With women empowerment serving as the league's core mission and vision, we are extremely thrilled to welcome one of the leading faces of putting female welfare at the forefront of public service, Senator Pia S. Cayetano. Ladies and gentlemen, it is with huge honor that I announce that the league's upcoming campaign will be known as the Pia Cayetano WNBL 2021 season. Thank you, Madam Senator, as generations of female bowlers will finally get to realize their dream. What men can do, we women can do the same, if not better as independent, strong-willed, and co-equal members of society. It also sends a message to those young girls out there that they can dream and coupled with hard work and prayers, their dreams will become a reality. This truly are exciting times for women's basketball and I hope that all of our players, teams, officials, partners, sponsors, and most importantly, you, our passionate fans, will be with us in every step of the way as we continue to make her story together. On behalf of our dear chairman, Celso Mercado, who would like to extend his congratulations to all of you, we would like to thank our stakeholders, team owners, players, NBL and WNBL staff. Let's all do our share in making this season 2021 for both leagues a big success. The fact that we all will be playing now makes us all champions but the ultimate goal like what i keep on telling everyone the ultimate goal is that we all start this season all negative from covid 19 and end this season again free from covid 19. i want to end this message with a personal anecdote i was once a dreamer like all of you and just seeing you all here today women bowlers it made one of my biggest dreams come true. 
It takes a Celso Mercado to believe in my dream. And I will forever be grateful to you, Chairman Soy. Mabuhay ang Tres Cantos with Com Edward. Thank you very much and may God bless us all. Mabuhay ang tunay na liga ng atletang Pilipina. Thank you very much for that inspiring message, Ms. Rose Montreal. Okay, now it's time to meet the various teams that will be competing in this season in the Senator Pia S. Cayetano WNBL Season 2021. To show that they are the queens, please welcome the Paranaque Lady Aces. Brimming with their winning instinct, here are the Stan Quezon Lady Spartans. Here's the ferocious and fiery, here are the Tagin Lady Generals. Eager to shine and succeed, here are the Glutagens Glow Boosters. And aiming to drown out the competition, here are the Pacific Water Queens. Some notable names in the Glutagen's Glow Boosters, Nicole Cancio, Julie Gula, Camille Claro, Samantha Tan, Kate Castillo, and Phil Cailet. And for the Pacific Honor Queens, just some notable players are Christine Cortizano, Pamela Payat, Jolina Go, Angel Arellado, Snow Peñaranda, and Valerie Mamaria. Head coach of the Glutagen's Glow Boosters, Coach Justin Anthony Tan, and head coach of the Pacific Water Queens, Coach John Paulo Takalinawa. After the opening ceremonies of the game between the Glutagen's Glow Boosters and the Pacific Pagsabayan Kahit anong nakaharang handang tapakan Bawat pawis na papatak Kada apak at yabag May kahalong pangarap Gustong maiangat MBL Ito ang higan ng bayan Nagaalap ang pusong handang makipagsabayan After the women, we now move on to the men Last year, the NBL experienced a transformation From being an amateur league to evolving into a professional league. Still, it remains true to its mission to serve as a premier homegrown development league in the Philippines. This season, the NBL is fortunate to have a partnership with Chooks2Go. Of course, 
Chukstago has been a constant advocate in the development of Philippine basketball in the country and on the world stage. Let's hear a message from Mr. Ronald Mascarinas, President and General Manager of Bounty AgroVentures Incorporated. In our efforts to grow regional leagues across the country, Chukstago has been supporting the National Basketball League Filipinas over its past two seasons. It has become the place where homegrown talents were able to showcase themselves. But now, the 2021 season of the league elevated them to professional players, making all of the players' dreams turn into reality. I would like to congratulate Chairman Soy Mercado, Rose Montiel, and Edward Aquino for the continued service for the Filipino athletes. Being part of one Chukstogo Filipinas we will give you whatever you need. In addition, we will have loads of surprises for everyone. Remember that you are competing for slots in the Champions League. Good luck everyone and never forget to show your puso para sa Pinas in every game. Kayo ang tunay na manok ng bayan. Maraming salamat po, Mr. Ronald Mascarinas, and of course, Chooks to Go for being part of this season. Now, let's get to know our teams for this season in the Chooks to Go NBL Pilipinas 2021 season. And inspired, here are the La Union Power. Let's listen to the message from the team governor of La Union Power. Masasaksihan na naman po natin ang muling pagbubukas ng tahanan ng tunay na homegrown, NBL Pilipinas. Nais ko po lamang ibarating sa ating mga, mga manunood, sa ating mga taga-suporta, sa ating mga teams, na lahat po ito ay ginagawa natin para mapanatili at palakasin ang sports, lalo na po ang basketball sa Pilipinas habang nilalabanan natin itong pandemya at patuloy natin susundin ng health protocols at mga kailangan para maging successful po ang ating liga. Mula po sa team ng La Union Power, binabati ko po kayo ng congratulations at mabuhay po ang NBL. Ready to trample the opposition. These are the Laguna Pistons. And let's listen to a message from the team governor of Laguna Pistons. Glistening in the face of adversity, here are the Muntinlupa Emeralds. Now let's listen to a message from the team owner of the Muntinlupa Emeralds. Magandang araw po sa ating lahat. We at Muntinlupa Emeralds believe that basketball should be both fun and rewarding. Fans and players deserve nothing less. And I believe that the entire NBL family, from the team owners, players, coaching staff, benefactors, and corporate sponsors, to the pool of referees and other game officials, all of us believe no stone unturned to ensure that the league's formula anchored on grassroots development becomes a major success story in the history of professional basketball league management. Indeed, history is being made this week with the holding of NBL's inaugural games that formalizes its transition into a professional league. Given our unique status as witnesses, participants and enablers in this momentous transformation of our beloved NBL, it becomes our shared responsibility to ensure that each game in the official NBL schedule brings out the best in us. And as the cliche goes, together, we can salamat po, mabuhay ang NBL, mabuhay po tayong lahat. 
eager to once again prove their supremacy, the Pampanga Delta. Always aiming for the top, here are the Paranaque Aces. Marching on as one, here are the Taguig City Generals. Vigilant, valiant, and brave, here are the Zamboanga Valientes. Let's listen to a message from the team owner of the Zamboanga Valientes. Congratulations to NBL Filipinas. It is our honor and privilege to be part of your professional league. Thank you to Ms. Rose Montreal, Commissioner Edward Aquino, Chairman Soy Mercado, and to all the officers and staff of NBL Filipinas. Your credibility, management, and vision is remarkable. Ito ang tunay na homegrown. On behalf of Sambuanga Valientes, thank you for giving us the opportunity and sincere heart since day one to represent our hometown, Sambuanga City. More power to you, and may you continue your advocacy to your homegrown talents. We are excited for another successful year. Mabuhay ang NBL. Viva Sambuanga Valientes. Aiming to raise her flag up high, the Bulacan Damayang Filipino Republicans. Pagsabayan Kahit anong nakaharang handang tapakan Bawat pawis na papatak Kada apak At yabag May kahalong pangarap Gustong maiangat Laro ng aking pinag-usayan Walang pake kahit na malatayan Kahit anong sabihin nila Wala akong pakialam sa Lahat ng bagay alam nyo na ba Hindi nyo ako maikukumpara Bawat laro sa aking kada pasa Sa alab na puso laging naasa Handang suguri ng lahat Tiganting manang at tapat Panis yan sa akin Sapagkat panalo ay aking hangat Mabigyan ang buhay Pangarap at ang arin na maging mahusay Sa daang matira matibay Ang kailangan ko lang ay magsanay Hindi na pwede na ako ay panginaan Lahat ng harang ay aking sasagasa A new team ready to charge forth The Mindoro Tamarao Disciplinados Now let's listen to a message from the team owner of the Mindoro Tamarao Disciplinados Magandang araw po sa ating lahat, lalong-lalo na sa pamunaan ng National Basketball League sa pamumunan ni Commissioner Edward at si Ma'am Rose, sa lahat ng mga coaches, sa lahat, sa GAB, sa inyo pong lahat, uh, sa lahat ng mga nag-participate sa NBL, um, magandang araw po. Um, during pandemic, napakahirap po pumasok sa ganitong liga. Pero dahil tayo po bilang punong bayan and kapakanan ng kabataan ang palagi iniisip natin isang magandang venue ito para maiiwas natin ang ibang kabataan natin sa pinagpabawal na gamot at yun yung number one pero syempre um, dahil nag-aaral pa din ng iba uh, isa din dahil modular so isa din sa napakagandang nag-iisip ng NBL na homegrown yung kinuha natin um, ito yung venue para sa mga kabataan Mindoreño Oriental, Occidental, Mindoro, na kabataan na magagaling mag-basketball and magaling sa, sa, sa larong basketball, sa sports na to. Uh, ito ay para sa inyo. And hopefully, uh, maging um, kuwaran kayo sa ibang kabataan ng Mindoreño. 
And sana sa lahat ng mga kabataan na bigyan ng pagkakataon na tulad namin na hindi ganun kadali na pumasok dito sa ganitong larong basketball dahil time, effort, money, lahat po ay ginugugun natin dito. Pero binibigyan natin tayo, binibigyan namin kayo ng pagkakataon para may pakita yung galing ng Mindoreño. So sa inyong lahat ng mga kabataan ng Mindoreño, panoorin nyo ang NBL, panoorin natin sabay-sabay at mag-cheer tayo para sa kanila. And siyempre sa lahat ng uh, bumubuo, maraming salamat sa pagkakataon at ang um, uh, polenyo disiplinado ay napasama sa NBL League. O, sa inyo pong lahat, sa mga, lahat ng mga kakatunggali namin uh, sa, sa sports, sports lang to, sa lahat ng mga gobernador na makakalaro natin, uh, sana pagbigyan niyo muna kami manalo dahil bago kami team, Peace. So, maraming salamat sa inyo, NBL, uh, Solar Sports, uh, coaches, uh, team managers. So, sa inyo pong lahat, kay Justin Tan, ng kapartner natin, sa inyo pong lahat, maraming maraming salamat, Ma'am Rose, Com. Edward, Gab, na nanggaling pa sa Oriental Mindoro. Sa lahat ng mga players, good luck. And, uh, rocks lang, laro-laro lang, huwag mong mag masyadong uh, magbanggaan. Maraming salamat, God bless you. Another new team barging into the competition. Please welcome the Quezon Barons. And here's a message from the team owner of the Quezon Barons. Nice ko pong ipaabot ang aking mainit na pagbati sa mga mandalaro at bumubuo ng National Basketball League para sa gagawing opening ng liga ngayong araw. Maliban sa paghubog ng physical at mental na kapasidad, Isang malaking bahagi ng kulturang Pilipino ang sports. Nang dahil dito, nakilala ang galing ng marami nating kababayan sa buong mundo pagdating sa iba't ibang larangan ng palakasan. At sa bawat pagkakataon, nagagawa nating magkaisa sa pagbibigay ng suporta sa kanilang laban na gagiging laban din ng buong bansa. Pagdating sa individual na paglago, pinapaalala ng sport ang kahalagahan ng tiyaga at pagpupursige upang magtagumpay sa buhay. At kaakibat ng partisipasyon natin sa mga sports activities ay ang pagkaroon natin ng disiplina na kinakailangan upang maging responsibling mamamayan ng ating komunidad. Dahil sa nakikita nating mahalagang gampanin ng sports sa ating lipunan, Binigyan prioridad po ng pamahalaan ang pagpapaunlad ng sports development program dito sa ating dalawigan. Nais ko din po sanang kunin ang oportunidad na ito upang ihayag ang aking buong suporta, lalong-lalo na sa mga manlalarong bumubuo na Team Quezon Barons. At sa mga iba pang mga kalahok sa ligang ito, samantalihin ninyo ang pagkakataong ito upang ipamalas ang inyong natatanging kakayahan. Nag-uumapaw na determinasyon at masinsing layunin na makapagbigay ng karangalan sa inyong lugar. Naway ialay ninyo ang inyong lakas at kakayahan upang bumuo ng isang mas eksklusibo at aktibong pamayanan. At magsilbi rin sana kayong inspirasyon sa ibang mga kabataan na nagnanais pagbutihin ang kanilang mga kakayahan sa mga napili nilang larawan ng sport. Hangad ko ang matagumpay na pagbubukas ng National Basketball League. Magandang araw, mabuhay kayo at mabuhay ang lalawigan ng Quezon. Now let's go to the team that is with us in venue today. Steadfast and fearless, here are the Spartan Sulong Stand.
maganda na makipagsabayan Kahit anong nakaharang handang tapakan Bawat pawis na papatak, kada apak at yabag May kahalong pangarap, gustong maiangat Laro ng aking pinag-usayan Walang pake kahit na malatayan Kahit anong sabihin nila, wala akong pakialam sa Lahat ng bagay, alam nyo na ba, hindi nyo ako maikukumpara Bawat laro sa aking kada pasa Sa alab ng puso, laging nga asa Handang suguri ng lahat, iganti man ang katapat Panis yan sa akin sapagkat panalo ay aking hangat Mabigyan ng buhay Pangarap at ang hari na maging mahusay Sa daang matira, matibay Ang kailangan ko lang ay magsanay Hindi na pwede na ako'y panghinaan Lahat ng harang ay aking sasagasaan Walang mahirap kung hindi paglalaanan Tapas at tapang sa bawat laban NBL, ito ang digan ng bayan Homegrown, handang makipagsabayan NBL, ito ang digan ng bayan Who's here for today here in Pampanga as represented by Mr. Alan Trinidad, Province of Pampanga Sports Development and Administration of Bren Zigiao Convention Center. Good afternoon, Pilipinas. Mabuhay ang NBL at WNBL na nag-iisang professional women's basketball league at uh, homegrown professional basketball league. In behalf of our beloved Governor Dennis Delta Pineda, our Vice Governor Nanay Lilia Pineda, we welcome you to our beautiful province and hospitable province, Pampanga. Mabuhay po kayo. Thank you for the warm welcome, Mr. Trinidad. Now, as part of this joint season opening for the WNBL and NBL, we will now have the oath of sponsorship for all our players. This will be led by Phil Inglet, the first ever draft pick of the WNBL. May we call on Ms. Phil Inglet? to the center of the court, please, for the oath of sportsmanship. all the players and the coaches to please stand up. Um, please raise your right hand for the oath of sportsmanship and repeat after me. In the name of all the competitors, I state your name, Phil Claudine Kainglet, pledge that we will take Part in these games in the true spirit of fair play and sportsmanship, respecting and abiding by the rules that govern them for the glory and the integrity of the sport and the honor of our teams. So help me God. Thank you, Phil. Now to formally lead us into the opening of our Senator Pia S. Cayetano Cup WNBL season, please welcome WNBL Ambassador Kiefer Ravenna. I now declare the 2021 Senator Pia Cayetano Chooks to Go WNBL Pro Season open. Thank you, Kiefer. Palakpaka naman for the official opening. Now there's one thing left to do to kickstart our NBL Pilipinas Chooks to Go Chairman's Cup Season 2021. 
May we now call on Commissioner Edward Aquino for some final words and the formal opening of this season's Chukstugo NBL Pilipinas Chairman's Cup. In behalf of our Chairman Celso Soy Mercado and the 11 teams na niniwala sa amin sa konsepto ng homegrown, maraming salamat po, uh, Chukstugo, Mr. Mascarinas. Maraming salamat po, Gov. Dennis Pineda, sa pag-imbita rito sa amin. Maraming salamat po sa mga teams na, mga team owners ng bawat kupunan. At maraming salamat din po sa hardworking women na si Ma'am Rose Montreal, kundi dahil sa kanya, walang WNBL at walang NBL. And now declared, the NBL Chairman's Cup Chooks to Go 2021 season open. Thank you very much, Com Edward, and there you have it. Thank you once again for joining us for this season opener. Good luck to all the teams. My name is Mark Zambrano, and may the best men and women win. Ipagsabayan Kahit anong nakaharang handang tapakan Bawat pawis na papatak Kada apak at yabag May kahalong pangarap Gustong maiangat MBL Ito ang higan ng bayan Nag-aalap ang puso Handang makipagsabayan